The overall goal of this procedure is to measure the total fatty acid content and composition in microalgae. This is accomplished by first preparing a sample containing a known amount of lyophilized algae biomass. The second step is to disrupt the microalgal biomass. Next, the lipophilic components are extracted and isolated. The final step is transesterification of the acylipids to fatty acid methyl esters. Ultimately, gas chromatography is used to quantify the fatty acids. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods, like graphimetric determinations, is that this method is very accurate and specifically measures all the fatty acids and no other lipophilic components. Demonstrating the procedure will be Wendy Avers, a technician from our laboratory. Before starting this procedure, determine the algae dry weight concentration in grams per liter in the culture broth as detailed in the listed reference. Transfer a volume of culture broth that contains 5 to 10 milligrams of algae dry weight to a glass centrifuge tube. Calculate the exact amount of biomass transferred using the biomass concentration determined previously. Centrifuge the sample for 5 minutes at 1200 Gs. Discard part of the supernatant, leaving approximately 0.25 milliliters in the tube. Next, resuspend the algae in the remaining supernatant by gently pipetting the pellet up and down and transfer the cell mixture to a bead beater tube using a 200 microliter pipette. Rinse the centrifuge tube and pipette tip with plus or minus 0.15 milliliters of milliQ water and transfer the liquid to the bead beater tube. Centrifuge the bead beater tube for one minute at maximum RPM to make sure no air bubbles remain in the bottom of the tube. When finished, lyophilize the material.